I, well, actually, probably at the end of my life, because I'm, I'm convinced, absolutely convinced I'm going to live to 120. So I've got like, quick maths, number of years to go, 80 years to go till I, uh, is that right? 70 years to go. Whatever what gets makes me you convinced you can live to 120? It's just in my head. I'm just absolutely okay. beyond the shadow of a doubt. I just know it to awesome. be true. Know it to be true. Probably a subject for another day. Yeah, um, like but so I'm going to live to 120. So it's a long way to go. And I think where I am now from this point onwards and a few years past until I get there, I will be very happy. So I will look back at the span of my life and think for the majority of my life, I was happy enough. If tomorrow a plane falls out of the sky and lands on my head and squishes me, probably far more dramatic than squishes me. But let's say that's what happens. I don't know. I, th I think I spent a fair bit of my teens and my 20s and probably some of my 30s aspiring to fit in and always be looking forward and not feeling I'm where I should be and I've talked you know we've talked about this on lots of episodes so I don't think I was and I think a lot of that was in my head rather than reality as you do you construct your own reality around me and I think I defined myself through a few bad spots but I think I projected that across all the good times as well um, and I think I'm, I'm becoming more and more aware of that retrospectively. So if it was today, I'd probably have some regrets about less mindfulness, less living the moment, not appreciating things for what they were. I don't, I don't exactly know how to describe it yet. But mm. and I don't, I think if you'd have said to me at the time, "Are you happy?" I'd have said absolutely yes. And I don't think I was unhappy. I don't think I had like you had. Um, Jose, I don't think I had like a depression period or anything else like that. I just think I worried too much and that probably ebbed away at my happiness more than I realised, given where I am now. And not material change, not outside things, nothing else. Just the fact that I perceive what I can control and where I'm going and happiness and stuff like that differently. I, real I probably realise retrospectively. Uh